Welcome. Today we're going to build a web and mobile application using Lance's low-code developer framework, which provides IT with loads of built-in functionality that requires no coding, and a user experience that's fully cross-browser and optimized for both mobile and desktop viewing. First things first, let's take a look at the responsive web application we're going to build. If we sign into the application using the built-in security, the first thing we see is our personalized dashboard. The dashboard can display anything. Workflow lists, unread email, corporate news, whatever. They're easy to set up and can be personalized for individuals or groups of users. Here is the employee application we're about to build. On the left is our search control, and when we select an employee, their details are displayed on the right. Let's take a look at some of the features built into the framework. Not only can we sort the search results by clicking on column headings, but we can further refine the search results too. Imagine we need to contact an employee but forgot his last name. We know he lives in Ohio, and we know his first name is Alan. Now I remember, Alan Stark. The framework also lets us send whatever's currently in our search results to an Excel spreadsheet, providing users with ad hoc reporting capabilities. So far, we've dealt with a single employee, but what if we needed to work with more? The framework enables users to become more productive by increasing the number of open items. Now, we can work with three employees instead of one. We can also reposition and resize panels to our liking, and the framework will remember those positions the next time we run the application. Better yet, the framework has an automatic tiling feature that will snap everything into place and position all the panels for us. We can maximize, minimize, and restore panels back to their original positions. The framework's application workspace behaves a lot like a Windows desktop, so sometimes it's easy to forget we're actually running a responsive web app. Another built-in feature is the option to display search results using a contact card layout. Since it's easy to flip between both styles, today we'll build both. Another capability of Lance's low-code developer framework is its ability to run Optimize for mobile devices as well. Notice the reduced number of columns in our grid, and also notice that the user workspace with multiple movable panels has been replaced with a single panel view that is better optimized for smaller form factors. Okay, now that we've seen what we're going to create, let's build it. The first thing we need to do is prototype our application design, the menus, navigation, searching, details, etc. Luckily, Lance's low-code developer framework makes that easy. We start by answering a series of questions. A typical HR system is comprised of employees, expenses, timesheets, payroll, etc. We're going to create an application that works with employees and select our favorite color for the menu. Next, we tell the framework which actions we want to perform with the employee. Here are six sample actions, and we'll choose the details action for employees. And last, we tell the framework we want a new HR menu and assign the new employee application to it. Okay, we're done. The last step is just reviewing the summary of what the framework will build, clicking finish, and then let the framework do its magic. Here's what our employee application looks like so far. Besides creating our nav menu, the framework also includes a simulated runtime engine so we can emulate the behavior of our application without writing a single line of code. Notice how the details panel knows we've clicked on employee number three. This is because the prototype is not a throwaway design. It's our application skeleton. And as you can see, the prototype contains all the framework features we saw before. We accomplished a lot in that 15 second exercise. We've built the entire responsive web architecture, the user workspace, all the built-in features, and all the plumbing to make it hang together. Using a two-step process, it's time to connect our prototype to the database. In step one, we choose the data we want to see in the search results from the employee table. Here's how we were able to add the additional filtering for that state column, the reduced number of columns in our grid, better optimized for the mobile version, and last, we just identified the key to the employee table. Click Finish, and we're done with step one. 
In step two, we generate the ability to search for, create, read, update, and delete employee details. After we supply a name, the framework will build all the necessary components for us. It only took us two steps for us to transition our prototype into a real working application. The only thing left to do is enable the dashboard option, and we're good to go. All right, let's check out our application. Here it is. As you can see, we've now built an application identical to the sample we saw before. It has the same dashboard, the same navigation, the same search and filter options, and the same desktop-like application workspace just by answering a few questions. How about we change the layout for the search results? By choosing the contact card layout, we can update our application without writing a single line of code. Here we are back in our application, and now when we perform a search, the data grid has been replaced by contact cards. Now that we've finally finished our application, let's focus on a couple other features within the Lanza platform that simplifies the development and maintenance of enterprise applications. Notice that some data elements are displayed as radio buttons, while others are displayed as checkboxes, dropdowns, etc. Where did that come from? Also, watch what happens when we try to update an employee with a blank first name. Where did that validation rule come from? The answer for both is the Lanza Rules Engine. The Lanza Rules Engine stores information like system-wide business rules and data visualizations, just to name a few. Here are all the business rules for the employee table, including the first name can't be blank rule we saw before. Now you can add many types of rules from very simple to very complex, and applying system-wide rules here greatly improves application development and future maintenance because everything is maintained in one spot and automatically enforced everywhere without having to recompile any of our applications. What about those visualizations? With Lanza, you can visualize any data element using a variety of standard options, or you can build your own. Adding visualizations greatly improves the speed of designing user interfaces and provides better consistency across all applications. While we're still here in the developer workbench, Imagine HR asks us to add a new data point, local weather, to the employee details screen. With Lanza, we have the flexibility to either rerun the wizard or drop down into code. Since we've already seen the wizard, let's update the generated code. Here is the employee detail screen that was generated by the framework. Let's drag local weather, which calls an API from weatherunderground.com onto our employee screen. All that's left to do is recompile and take a look at our updated application. Here is the updated application. Let's find an employee so we can check out their local weather conditions. And there it is. Now how easy was that? We were able to add local weather to the employee detail screen in just a matter of seconds. And while we're checking out the mobile version, let me explain what makes Lanza unique in the low code space. Lanza doesn't force developers to wade through multiple layers of web technologies and open source frameworks to make changes. Instead, Lanza provides developers with an environment where all changes can be made from a single language and one developer workbench. I want to thank you for joining me today while we discovered how Lanza's low-code developer framework enables IT to quickly build modern web and mobile applications with full control and no constraints. To learn more about how Visual Lanza can revolutionize your IT department, contact Lanza for a demo or to sign up for a test drive.